Welcome to my channel. This is Spacey Tracy Nails. I'm going to be doing a uh, tutorial today, and it is going to be um, water marbling, but not your traditional water marbling. It's going to be on a stamping plate, and I have not seen these on YouTube yet, but uh, you might have been on Instagram. I haven't. I, I looked the other day, but I didn't see them, so I'm, I was kind of hoping I'd be one of the first ones to do this one at least. Um, I know I'm really new to this, so you're going to see some of the things that you've probably already seen on other ones, but hey, um, I see that a lot of people have a lot of problems with their water marbling. It's not just me. Oh, do you have a plate that you use that's for water marbling? If you do, why don't you just let that... Um, put that down below in the comments of what plate you use, okay? Um, first off, let's uh, just say welcome to my channel again. Thank you for coming and watching me. I appreciate you following me with my journey. I am also not very consistent with my uploads at this point, or right at this moment. So if you'd like to get notified when I actually put up a video, then hit the notification um, bell. And if you like my videos, hit that like button, subscribe, and share my videos, and help. it would be greatly appreciated to help me grow my channel. Alright, so let's get to this little thing that we're going to be doing here. Um, I'm going to be using some clear jelly um, stamping polishes, and um, Manny Elegy stamping polish, and a Uber chick um, stamper and what's on my nails at this point is starstruck and it is on my ring finger and my pinky and my thumb and then I have strawberry fields forever and that is on my first finger and my middle finger okay that's what we have on my nails, so we don't need them in here anymore. The plate that I'm going to be using is the CJS223. And I haven't used it yet. I've been waiting to do this, so I wanted to sh do, you know, when I go to use the plate, that's when I take it off. That means I've used it unless I've bought it through a D stash, and of course, then the stuff is off of it. Um, or, if, you know, sometimes you might get it with the, the film on it, but most of the time you get them with them off, it looks like. Um, I have my stamper um, little pad here that I use. It's really cool because you have a lid to it. And I probably showed that to you guys, it, but I wanted to show it again. I just did something recently, too. I thought I'd throw that out there. Um, I saw somebody about doing these latex that you can get from Amazon. So I did that. And... Uh, Oh, wow, it's like seven bucks. I think I got it. Yeah, because it was on sale. It was like nine ninety nine or something, and then I got it for seven or something. And then um, I think I got another twenty percent off of it actually. And then I just used this little funnel, and I cleaned out my little Etsy bottle, and I put it in there. And I liked it this one because it is actually smaller for the. I don't know if you can see it in there. This it's smaller, a brush, and so I thought I might have a little bit more control with it to do that. And since I'm going to start doing more and more art, I, I just felt that I needed to start using this because then I think I'll venture out a little bit more on my um, art because of that. So, all right. Um, I also use this little alley mat because I wouldn't want to get my mats dirty, you know. <laughs> That's what they're for, but I like to keep them nice and clean as much as possible. So I like to use these little alley mats and uh, put that, put my plate on there and then that way um, it just goes on here and then you just clean it off um, off there the just you know really quick and then you can clean your mat afterwards as well all right uh, here is my um, cloth for my uh, cleaning my plates and I have just this looks like it's a uh, XY 201 um, scraper. It's a little bit more flimsier, so I was having a little bit easier time with that, but we'll see if it works with this plate, because I haven't used this plate. First off, what we're going to do... Oh, and then um, I just got these. They were $2 each. $2! Can you believe that? Um, I was just 
Wow, I didn't even know they had 10 ones either. I had gotten their 5 ones when I very first started getting wanting to do stamping and wasn't good at it and got frustrated, but it was like 2018. So, yeah, it was 2000. Yeah, I think that's when it was. I went back and looked. So, here this one is 031, and then this one is 029. They are a pink and a purple metallic. So, I was kind of going, and then I have the Maniology Frozen. I just got this one. I was so excited. I didn't know that this was the white one that everybody's been talking about, and I finally figured it out. I, I sometimes are a little spacey on trying to figure out things. So, um, and, and then I don't know if, if I have ever said that. I said that if you can go down and read down below if you'd like. I don't know um, if you guys know, would want to know or why I do it, but I named my um, nail channel Spacey Tracy Nails um, due to the fact that Spacey Tracy used to be a bully name for me. And I'm making it into a positive and just show you how much I can grow with um, learning with this nail art. And I absolutely love nail art. So this is something that since I'm, I, I have lots of issues, I, this is really helps me. So, but see, look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Two dollars. Yeah, I'm really um, going to be keeping an eye on Clear Jelly um, Stamper, and I noticed that if you uh, go and join on their Facebook, um, they put notices on there when they're doing sales, and then I did their little um, text thing so that I can get their sales, because when they do sales, it's unbelievable. I'm just really flabbergasted when they, you know, even if it's discontinued, I don't really care. I, I just like that I'm getting these items, so this one is... The plate is CJS223. Okay. Now we're going to open it up finally. I've had it for a little bit, but I thought I was going to get this done a little sooner. And my body said no. So now I'm finally getting to it. And I'm really excited. Let's get it done here. All right. Now. I want to take this off and throw that away. Also, um, I wanted to let you guys know, I'm not sure if you guys know, but somebody had told me that you can get these cards for all of your plates if you don't have any. Like, I got a bunch of ones that were discontinued and and uh, defected and stuff, and they say you can get the cards. So I, th I, th I was like, oh my goodness, I didn't know that. That's really cool. But I've never seen them on both sides, so... That's kind of cool. Oh, it's step by step. That's pretty cool. Look at that. It shows you exactly how to do the colors, I guess. That's really neat. Very neat. And I think I'm going to be going kind of more of an abstract looking in, in here. This is where I was. This is the general one that I think I'm going. Um, but I'm going to have to figure out where it is on here. I have a little bit of a problem with that too, but it looks like it's this one right here. I think. Yeah, I think it's what it is. So yeah, right here, right here and here. Yeah. So, all right, look, that's pretty cool. Now, first off what you do when you pull, you need to pull the, the blue film off. It's very important to get the blue film off. And for some reason, their plates have been coming with two. So there's one. And we'll just make the sound. There's one. Yay! <laughs> and then, we're going to go with one more here. If I can get it. And I just take them with my little tweezers that I put my little pencil things on that I got from the dollar store. Because I like things that I can grab hand grab with. And um, these are nice and good for me for that why I put them on all of my brushes as well. See? But these are from Amazon and stuff. But the real cheap ones and stuff, um, I did them with them too. See? Look at that. It's pretty cool, huh? If you have a hard time with holding things, that's a good idea, actually. Um, you can get them from the dollar store. I will try to see if I can... The, I, mine are old, old, because I use them from when I do drawings on my iPad. I put them on my Apple Pencil. But um, I will see if I can find some links on them. 
uh, and the dollar store you just or the dollar tree you just go look at there I don't uh, know if you have everybody doesn't all have dollar trees so alrighty now we are going to use the purple and I'm gonna do that over the pink okay that's where my plan is here and then I was gonna do this white uh, the, the frozen and so this is gonna be the two here and then this one I'm gonna do with the pink and the the frozen but I may and I'll just put that out there this zero three five I possibly may use this one too now that I see that it does have three little things that I'm going for here all right now I wanted to go ahead and get out my wonderful latex and we are going to go ahead and put that around my nails because I have finally figured out that if I do that I'll be able to do a lot more work on my nails if I just go ahead and start doing this but I all the ones I got I tried the glue that didn't work um, you know all the little hacks that you could do I tried them and they didn't work I was not impressed uh, at first you know I was like oh, okay that's cool but now that I'm getting really into it and stuff and thinking well that's not gonna work because then you don't want to do it if you if it's too hard you just don't want to do it and that's not what I was trying to do I was trying to actually like doing this not making myself more irritated about it so all right now there we go I just wanted to show you guys real fast that I was putting that on and I will be right back and I'm gonna go ahead and put on the rest of this on all of my other ones and I'll be right back all right we got one more to do and it's just my pinky and the reason I'm, I'm coming back, I wanted to show you guys this 3D printer. Uh, I think I might have showed them in one of them. I'm not sure where I show things, but I will have it linked down below as well uh, where you can get them. Uh, Girly 66, I think, is the one that I saw them with. But she got hers from a different place. I'm positive of that. But this is similar. Um... And the one thing I liked about this one is if they have any defect ones, anything that, and it didn't, I mean, I got some stuff that they don't even look like, I don't, I mean, maybe the color, maybe they made it for somebody and they didn't, didn't want it. Um, they give it for cheaper. So I just wanted to show you guys how this works. It's kind of nice because you can, um, like, do your thumb like that that's what I like about it it's really easy to use for that kind of a thing you see you just kind of it just stabilizes your hand so, all right let me let this dry and then I'll be right back okay I'm back now this video might be a little longer than I was hoping for but until I get better at this, I was kind of trying not to do a voiceover this time. So let's see what happens here. Um, now, I'm thinking, and this is my thinking, and you guys, if I do it and then it doesn't look right, you guys can give me it. Or you guys can give me suggestions anyway. It doesn't matter. Um, so it looks like that there's three colors on this one, and that's what I think I'm going to do. I'm going to make it so that the fourth color... I mean the third color we're gonna just knock this one in and every one of them and I think it'll go pretty good with all of them all right um, the one okay so one goes this way I guess you just match them up and if you match them up and this one is this one must be this one and this one is this one and this one right here is that one all right now let's get to doing this and see how it all goes oh first whoa totally whoa 
Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> hold the boat, hold the boat. Okay, let's try one more thing. We need to clean off the plate. When they're new like this, you really should clean them because they might have some stuff on them and you might yeah. Um, the residue and all that stuff might be on them and causing them, uh, make it so that you can't pull the uh, image up as well or the, there just might be some stuff on it so it's good to clean it I do that with a hundred percent acetone with my nice little uh, claw there and then I take um, a paper towel and just kind of go back over it a little bit more and then um, I'm using a hundred percent acetone over to the side here and here we go. All right, now it's nice and clean. Now, now we can do this. All right, let's go ahead and do, um, oh, I'm just trying to decide. Okay, we'll go with the purple first, okay? And I think I'll just kind of mix them up. Now, what I did do with these, because they were really, 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 really thick, um, is I went and I got some Amazon um, stainless steel little balls to put in them. I'll just show you real fast uh, to put two of them in there. I'm going to put them in all my old ones too. Um, it helps just mix them up. And it said that if you don't mix them up really well, then you might not get the full potential of it. So we'll go here and then we're going to go ahead and I used the wrong one. I used the wrong one. <laughs> I lost my scraper. Oh, I used the wrong one. I was going to do the other one first, but that's okay. You know, hey, maybe that was the way it's supposed to work. So I scraped once, and then I'm going to take my Uber roll and there's the first one and we're gonna just kind of see if you guys can see it so I'm just gonna kind of roll it on my nail and I'm kind of pushing it down just a little harder just so that I want to make sure I got on there so there it is there's the first one. Oh, I'm so excited these are so cool okay all right, and now you clean off your lint, not on my um, little uh, sticky pad thing here, or sticky roller, and I cleaned off my wonderful little um, Uber Chick uh, stamper, which is a clear jelly one, and it has a, um, it has a lid to it, see? So... Alrighty, now let's go with. I'm thinking I'm gonna do the the white here. Now I'm gonna go and I'm gonna change them off and on, the different ones, you know, like. And I won't make you watch all of them. I just want to get a, the first one done, and then we'll come back and I'll show you, or maybe a couple of them done. I know that my video is gonna be kind of long, but. It's kind of the way I am right now until I can get better at it. But okay, so there we go. And I'm not really lining them up because I kind of felt like when you do water marbling, it's not really uniform in my opinion. It can be all over the place. That's the cool thing about it. I'm just over here cleaning off my wonderful Uber chick. Uh, stamper and now we're gonna do the um, this uh, purple right here shake 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 your booty okay now <laughs> let's go ahead and do that and I'm gonna use my and I'm just kind of scraping once trying not to dig in there I think that was one of my problems that I was having is I was actually grabbing them too, you know, too much. Now this might not show up very well. 
Yeah, that color really didn't show up that well. Maybe we just won't use that color anymore. So I don't think that color is really, um, eh, is a deal to do. Um, so here I did it again. I have to go put a little bit of latex back on. I will be right back. <laughs> All right, I'm back. We're gonna just let this dry really fast. First off, we're gonna clean off the plate really well. So there we go. Cleaning off the plate. And now we are going to do the pink on here. And then I will do the rest so you guys don't. And then we'll come back and I will be putting on smudge free top coat. And then I will put on um, KB Shimmer, I think, is going to be my to uh, fast top coat, but we'll see what it is in a minute when I'm done. All right, now we're going to do this pink right here. I tend to put it all over my design. Some people say they don't do that. They just, you know, like only put it over um, half of it. But that's just me. And I'm not very, you know, I'm new at doing all this. So you guys do what you need to do on that. It does not matter how, I mean, as long as it, you get it to work, I guess that's fine, right? Okay, so let's put that down there. So there's that one. And over here cleaning it off again 100% and then we're gonna do the white because that that purple isn't gonna do anything um, for me and I don't think we're gonna need both of them either but who oh, let's just go ahead and try the purple one more time that's what I think that's what I think let's try it one more time Okay, now I am rolling it on because I don't think I rolled it on very well that time or a minute ago. Oh, I did it again. Whoops. Ah, I made it. I made it. I didn't take it all the way off that time. Okay, so now we're going to try one more time with this purple. That one didn't get all the way up there, that's why I did that. And then, as you can see, there it is. And I am going to go a little up there this time because I didn't go all the way up there. So there it is. There is that one. And that'll smooth down, I'm sure, once I put a top coat on. So there's that one. And there's that one. I like that one better, but they're taking over my nail colors. I could have maybe done more dominant colors. But what do you guys think? What colors would you have used? Or do you think I'm, you know, my colors are wrong? Or what do you guys think? Okay, I would love to know. All right, so I am going to go and finish this one and this one and this one, and then we'll come back and we'll put a top coat on it and. Uh, I'll have pictures at the end, but I will be right back. All right, I'm back. I have decided that we're, I've, I'm not going to just do them, that design. Um, I think my nails will be a little bit too busy. So we're, I am going to do other designs as well. And uh, while I'm doing that, let's go with, I'm going to try... this one for my yeah I'm gonna try this one with a little bit of that I think or maybe this one this one and this one 
Yeah, I'm not really sure. Uh, it's hard because I'm not very good at the water marbling in the water. So I'm not really sure, even though I've got this little wonderful card, getting a little confused on what would be the best way to make it look right. But you know what? It doesn't matter because everything is everything. You know, it, 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 it doesn't have to be perfect. That's what nail art is, right? Now, what we're going to do is just do this one right here. Changed my mind again. I'm good at changing my mind. I change it a lot. So let's go ahead. And then I clean off my um, scraper too uh, when I see that it's starting to cake on there. I don't do it every time, but yeah, when it starts getting all over the place, I try to clean that up too. I probably clean more than I do any of the other stuff. Now, I kind of went scraped twice, but I think it's because I had so much on there that I thought it, I needed to. Oh, here we go. We're going to just, we're going to go ahead and put it right there. See? And there it is. Yeah, I think that's a great idea. See? And then... I'm going to take the snow, um, this, uh, the, the white one, the frozen, I can't get my mind on what I was trying to say, but the frozen one, and I am going to put it over there to the side. And see how that looks. So there it is. And then I'm just going to kind of go over here to the side. If you see it. See right there. And then I think I'll just go ahead and put that right there. It just happened to be there. <laughs> I had some on there. That's the kind of cool thing about it. With nail art you can just grab if there's other stuff on your, you know, um, if you don't want to just clean it off, you can use what's on it for another part of it or whatever. I don't think that will fit there, but let's just see if it will. Well, there we go. Yeah, I like that. And what I've noticed that water marbling is really not, unless you're awesome at it, it's supposed to be kind of more of a abstract type look and if I'm not right then you guys can let me know but that's kind of what I was thinking so all right cleaning my plate off with 100% acetone and now what I'm going to do is use this one for my pinky so we're going to do that with my pinky and I'm going to use this purple and, and try not to scrape too hard and roll it on there and then here we go try not to get it's really hard to do it through the viewfinder of your phone I don't have the greatest eyesight so it's very difficult for me sometimes to do that. Okay, so I just put that in the middle. Um, but I think I'm going to do it with a white. Anyway, we're going to go back with that. I don't particularly like that at all. So clean off my plate again. And we're going to take that one right there. Again, like I was saying, flip my plate around a little bit. And these are kind of big, but I'm growing out my nails. That's the reason I did it, so I could actually have a little bit more real estate to put more stuff on my nails. <laughs> and I have to do fake ones all the time to practice. 
So we're going to do that one right there. And I think we'll do that right there. What do you think of that? Not bad. I mean, it's different. I don't think it's turning out too bad. All right, so now we're. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to clean this off again. 100% acetone all over the plate. Here we go. All over the plate. All right, now my voice is a little bit better today. <laughs> Thank goodness. Um, I think what I'll do is we'll go ahead and go back to this kind of similar thing right here. But we're going to go with more of these two right here. If you can see them, just try to stay in the camera. It's good to stay in the camera, right? All right, now let's go ahead and just put this right here. And we'll do the white first. Yay! It's turning out. Yes, it is. It's turning out, guys. Now, I don't know if that turned out. I don't like that at all. See, that just... I must have did a boo-boo there. Um, it must have when I scraped it twice. Or maybe the, the plate's not nice and clean. Maybe it had some of that stuff on there. I don't know. What do you guys think? How does that happen? And then if I stamp it, does it really stamp bad like that? Or is it still stamp right? No, so I've, I've seen some people do it and then it looked like it's fine. But I've done it and it doesn't look like it goes on fine. It gets like this cloudy thing there. See, there it's doing it again. Not sure what I'm doing wrong there. But okay, there we go. That's good. That's not too bad. But I really don't want all that. So we're just going to clean that off a little bit with my wonderful little and then we're going to just kind of put this one on like that see that's pretty cool I mean every time my visions of what I think that I want that Manny to turn out to be like never turns out to be like I want it to be so then I don't want to really like I, I I feel like I need to edit it and make it all, but I told you guys that I was not going, I, I need to let you guys see what I'm doing and what I'm not doing, right? If I want you guys to see that I'm learning and I can't be perfect and I'm not going to be, and I know this video is very long, I apologize for that, but... Uh, Maybe you guys need to make dinner or something and you're just watching me while you do your nails. I, that's a great idea. You know, watch me while you do your nails. So we're going to go... Oops. My camera is not wanting to succeed for me today. So... There it is. I really like that one. I think that's the best one of them all. I mean, that one turned out pretty cool, too. But, all right. Now, I just want to do one more thing, because I am not liking that. I'm just not. So we'll put a dark purple on there, okay? That's what we're going to do. We're going to do a dark purple. And... Um... Maybe like something down here. That's what I'm going to try. Because I know it's the pinky. Small pinky. But uh, mine are nice and skinny ones there. You know, longer. And then they do the, I guess they're called a, I have a deep C. See, look at that. Oh. Alrighty. Now we're going to go ahead and... Try it again. Roll. Roll, baby, roll. Okay. Uh, 
it didn't turn out the way I wanted it either. There we go. I mean, that's not my favorite one. So, all right, I'm going to go and clean all this off and I will be right back. And then um, I'm going to go ahead and put this on. Most of you guys know how to do that smudge free top coat. And I'm also um, going to put a top coat on and I will have pictures at the end because I've really made a long video here. Um, I also everything will be down it will I'll have everything down in the uh, below down below uh, of all of the things that I used uh, and uh, just want to let you guys see how I can just get this off one time it is actually really a good thing see look at that so oh and then somebody was saying if you do if you put them together eventually, see I didn't do that right that time. Right, let's try it one more time. Well, never mind. All right, I'm gonna go clean these up and leave the pictures like I said. I, I don't think they turned out too bad. But I just wanted to also let you guys know that I appreciate you coming and watching me. I know this is a long one and I'll try to do more of some voiceovers when they're long but I knew this one was going to be it because I'm not really good at water marbling and I guess I, I did a lot of research but it still didn't it just didn't turn out in my my vision didn't go out on my nails <laughs> and that happens a lot so there it is look at that isn't it I think they turned out pretty cool and I think when I put the top coat on them, they'll look really good. So, all right, guys. This is going to be Spacey Tracy signing off. Finally. We'll talk to you later. Uh, again, Spacey Tracy, Nails, signing off.